Hello YouTubers, this is the creator of TNHB, and this is a video showing how to set up Wally. What Wally is, is it's a program for uh, making custom sprays in Counter-Strike and Half-Life and Valve games that are Half-Life based. Uh, first thing I do is download it and read the description. I have a link for this as well as other things. So you don't have to read the description that says video. Uh, I've already downloaded it, so I'm just going to show you the steps. You extract it from the XE. It'll tell you where, to, where it's going to unzip to. You hit unzip. I've already got it unzipped, so I'm going to skip that step. Then you open your C drive, and you go to Wally. -E. Now you open Wally. -E. Uh, this will open, it'll say blah blah beta version. Don't worry about that. You open a new document, a new texture. You make sure it says half life package wad 3wad You hit OK. Now you get this untitled thing. Now you have to open your picture. Now there's a lot of problems with this. Is the um, thing has to be a certain size or else it won't work. If it's too big, it won't open it, and you won't be able to make the spray. I'll just show you what happens if you open a picture that's way too big. It won't let you. It has to be divisible by 16. It has to be divisible by, by 16, and when you multiply the dimensions, it has to be smaller than 14,000. Um, it has to be also be a bitmap format, or else it won't work. This is a chart to show you how big it has to be. It'll say yes if it's okay for that size. Uh, it goes up to 256 but that's as large as you can have it. The largest square you can have is... Um, let me see this chart. Is 96 by 96. It's a small picture, but in the game, it's a lot bigger. So let's give you a look at this chart. find this picture anywhere on the internet that uh, was, is talking about custom sprays. So anyways, the step you do is you go to the picture, you copy it, and you go paste as new. I just realized something that the picture is a uh, bitmap, well uh, not a bitmap, there's an easy way to fix that. Open paint. Open the picture. And save it as a bitmap. 24 bit, doesn't matter. There, now it's in bitmap format. Let's get to this. Eh, why is my mouse doing that? Yes, I'm sure. I want to delete the item. I'll just do that. Just open a new one. Just give me a second here, YouTubers. Now you open it, see bitmap. Look how small the picture is. Now copy it. Paste as new. And I'll see it's got flags. Sky, random filling, tiling rather, tiling. Toggled anime animated blah, blah blah says it doesn't have flags however the first character the name devotes its property I don't care so I just put in random filling a little random filling and now you see how it doesn't have anything else it's just got 
file edit wizard package view and help. Now look, it, it changed. Now with this, you have to go to colors edit palette. You click the bottom right and you change the numbers to the following. You don't hit blend. Do not hit blend. Hit OK. If some of the pixels turn blue, just get out the little brush on the side and all the stuff and change it back. If it doesn't, don't worry about it. Just close it. Just close the picture. I'll ask you if you want to save changes. You hit yes. Now I'm gonna do is this is you save it as this. This is the same one, so it doesn't really matter. You have to have, save it as temp.ecal.wad. Now for the final step, you gotta go to this uh, part, wherever your game is installed. will change this thing right here it's whatever the name of your steam account is then slash uh, condition zero is if, if that's the game you're playing though if it's not then I'll go to that one this is just the one I have it at because it's the one I play and there's there's your uh, path it might might be different but it's pretty much the same path and now when you go there when you go there you have to delete uh, the other temp decal I know I just spelled delete wrong but whatever you have to delete that one and you'll also have to delete custom dot h p k you delete that file right here this one and then you copy and paste the spray file you made into this So when you take your spray, you go into this thing after you copy it. You go into this path, you delete the other one in that folder, and then you delete this. Then you paste the spray file you just made into that folder. And there, just close it down, and then you're done. That's all it. That's it. It's done. Finito. Fin. Finished whatever but that's how you do it that's how you make a spray I find Wally is the best one out of all of them to make they got all their temp stuff too but that's how you make them uh, I should keep the, the that one can go so anyways, that's how you make a spray. Uh, please keep checking back for the videos I put up on YouTube. I thank you for watching them, and have a good day.